What's up guys, Poke here from Castle Clash and today in this video we are gonna make part one of my altar review. The altar review it's it will take a long time if I explain all of them one by one. So what I want to do is as part one, we're gonna browse through quickly and I will go into detail what heroes are important to me personally and maybe to the stream. And then you're gonna leave me like uh, 3,000 likes. Oh, just kidding. Now you're gonna leave a lot of likes so that I'll make part two and let me know what you want me to get into in detail and also what you want me to do in the near future because right now I have about 20 plus heroes. I, will, I wanna guess about 23 that is not maxed out in Destiny and I have all heroes and um, it's only, well, there's quite a few not eight of eight talent as well. Yeah, but everybody else skill is max, inscription is max and traits no I'm, i will not spend gems to make everything five and five or whatever so this 460 is my altar with four four extra slots that's for i don't know what we're gonna do in the future so we're gonna go from the greens and the blues i have all the greens and the blues it's just my personal preference don't ask me why i just want to have everything it's like a collectibles to me i know a lot of people they're like ah oh, eat the greens and the blues so that you have more might you can get purple heroes, but I have four empty slots anyway, so you're not going to make me do that. We have all the greens, all the blues, and then we got the purples. We're going from here. These are the kind of like guidelines. These are just like the from outside, right? We're going to go into it really fast from the front later on. The sounds pretty good, pretty chill too. Oh, what's up, Yao Hing? Wow. We just slowly scroll from right to left. That's the talent. And then we're just going to go quickly talent. Let me let me take a sip of my electrolyte water. I do not have. I have only one Lavanica. Are you guys ready? So, Scorch. I don't know. It's it just cool. Full work was good. And Spirit Mage, Ninja with War God. Come on, it looks cool. Level seven Succubus. Yeah. And coolness level of Flame Guard. Flame Guard Champion, Druid, slow down because of Archdemon back in the day. Come on, War God, Thunder God, what's not to like? War God, Grizzly Reaper, especially. Level in Atlantic Core, Revitalize 5, level 7, Snowzilla, Flame Guard, Flame Guard, Immortet. These are just extra Flame Guards, you know what I mean. War God, level 7, Vlad Dracula. Slow down, this was when uh, Archdemon, one of the Archdemon. And Flame Guard Orcsbane, War God Santa Boom, War God Pixie, Heavy Blow Siren. I gotta make that level eight, I mean, even though I don't play Archdemon anymore. And Revitalize Destroyer, that guy right there. And then we have RP Queen Sunder. Um, let me see. Oh yeah, that's you have the scatter. And then we have a flame guard. I should have done this from the no, it's okay. This this works too. And then we have bulwark and flame guard backup. That's just how much flame guard I'm rolling every other day. Like before. We got flame guard and revitalize. Scatter. Zerg. Slow down. And then how long is this video? Oh, it's only been four minutes. Alright. Revitalize. Flame guard drag axe. Flame guard. What's his name? I don't even know what his name. Revenant. Bulwark. And we got we got the damage Anubis right here. We got the combo package. And then we got the defensive Anubis right here. I still like the Flame Guard better. I don't know why. The Scorch and the Bulwark just for fun. 
and this is a damage and berserk and this is the flame guard this is the scatter i used to have her for lava and infernal summit one when it was just released this is the flame guard rock no oh my god so many flame guard dude the flame guard of uh <laughs> magtessa this is the dem is supposed to be the damage but not so good i like this better and then this guy right here i don't even use as much anymore i like flame guard better honest opinion from from my heart from the heart this is flame guard athene flame guard esperita flame guard storm eater professor rivet with this new talent i was just trying but it's rubbish so this is uh because because he has damage caps so i want to deal as much damage as i can while i have enough hp to hold on in that two second window and we have a uh, bulwark asura i haven't really get really into asura because i haven't been playing arena so much and this is so far so good so i'm not changing zerk zerk 8 mahatma man there's so many heroes these days and then we have level 8 bulwark level 8 stone skin i can actually make level 8 flame guard golem too if i want to and the cupid i haven't touched for so long we have flame guard Voltanica. we have minotaur with this was the two best talents and then they have unholy pack after that unholy pack my new toy trixie treat with unholy pack right here and aries is still old school level eight this is the damage demo gorgon and then this is the flame guard demo gorgon the bulwark was the og demo gorgon that i have yes it's flame guard everywhere so this is my empower pumpkin duke i don't use the zerk anymore i had a video about it comparing the three talents and this is i think one of the best talent for pumpkin duke we got to make a separate video about this and the flame guard valentina of course i ate my other valentina so be gone this is a pretty cool medusa while it lasted and this is zealous drive Heartbreaker that we're gonna we're gonna test out next week if we do well with this. So Flame Guard Grimfiend. What what do you expect, right? I got Flame Guard everything. This is also I believe one of the best talent for Skeletica. And oh let's unlock this to get a Scorchy Scorchy. And Vital Boon because it was new talent. And of course you gotta have the Flame Guard Michael too. And let's unlock this thing. Peace. And we got the Flame Guard Sass, Unholy Pack, Dove Keeper, and let's open this. Ooh, look at you, level 5 Zerg, done on live on video, level, level 8 Flame Guard Serena, and the blues and greens, we just go over it quickly, it's, uh, oh, I have a level 8, oh, this is just for fun right here um and there you go now as far as what are we doing next i mean as far as pets i mean my ordinary ones are max but aside from that i'm i'm just being cheap i haven't bought all the event only pets lately these are max 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 glacy 27 31 32 32 33 i think my 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 elephant is my elephant is max mini Angie is almost max that's what's up what is next will be equipment flame guard clash that's true we have oh man i don't even know how to how to do this like how to do this fast like that it's like it's mostly accuracy I, I gotta tell you i mean this this is like i'm gonna leave this for the next video i take i'm just gonna do whatever i think is uh my favorite hero and enchantment wise like lavonica right yeah victory lunge hell accuracy and i showed this one and hell accuracy this is the heroes that i like personally like even storm i don't really use as much anymore but i know a lot of a lot of people love storm eater i'm gonna show you that this this uh this chick right here has hp because uh, i don't know she she doesn't snipe for me personally and dove keeper of course you're not gonna heal and i'm gonna hit you for sure sass like that Athene, I used to love Athene until update happens. And Lavonica, yeah, everything's like that, dude. You know me. Mm. 
Gunslinger. Oh boy. Anubis. Anubis is pretty important. Heartbreaker. Even heroes like this, I call utility. Put revive on Athene. I have revive. Uh, hey, what's up, Hermet? Oh my god, your name, dude. You're gonna get me demonetized. Dude. <laughs> I'm just joking. Um, what is this? Little Nick. Utilities. You have to have accuracy. Doesn't matter. Okay. Dracax. Oof, when am I gonna use Dracax again? Ronin strategy impossible on my base. You'll never know. You never know. Um, if you want to try, you can too. Let me know which heroes you want me to put. Um, yeah. So for for to go into more details, let me know in the comment section. Don't forget to you know the more likes, the more I'll be more, the more I'll be motivated to do it. What is uh, what is the next? What is the next thing that you need to see in terms of altar review? The warden, right? The warden. Oh my god, so lazy. Still at 34. My friends, a couple of my friends promised to to uh, coach me with this. And wardens are like that. 34. I only purchased once to get it up to 34. If not, it would have been maybe 31 or 29, something like that. But I think that's that, right? Is there anything else? Well, huge shout out for Ramon. The leader of League of Goats? Ramon the Goat? Yeah, that's that's my guild. And what else should I say in this video? What else am I missing, guys? Uh, yeah, the Warden is tough. I mean, what else before we go? Before I end this specific video. Who gives the most donations from my guild? Okay, okay. Ramon. Oh my god. Oh, it's so fermented. I can't watch. I can't watch. That is... That is fermented right there. My dude. <laughs> Uh, where am I at? Oh, uh, how much did I did I donate? I'm a hundred thirteen thousand. <laughs> What's the best talent for Athene? Is gotta be Flame Guard. She's immune to uh, to calamity. But anyways, comment section below. That's my altar. I have. Oh, I'm probably gonna purchase when they're selling fame like peanuts again and probably gonna max everybody out what do you guys think and what uh what what heroes do you want me to go in detail about my altar let me know in the comment section you know what to do as always you guys are awesome and okay out